Hello and welcome! My name is Hugh and this is my Let's Play series of the Rufen Series 4 where we are playing as Denmark. Uh, last episode we didn't do that much. We fought down... I think we fought down the rebellion or we just finished it in the episode before. But we're basically just waiting for uh, Sweden to be integrated right now. Uh, we did upgrade our fleet so at least we got that done. Um, so yeah. Right now we're basically just waiting for Sweden to be integrated, which is of course also part of the reason why we're doing bad in Diplotech is because we've been integrating both Norway and Sweden. Um, hopefully that means that integrated elites will probably have... I'm not sure if that the... it's probably not paid for the idea group because it is 7 times 400 but it had helped us a little bit and we did needed some kind of yeah, at least the aggressive expansion thing is nice. I'm not sure if that was the best idea. It helped us. I think like the um, income from vessels helped us. Um, and we did just need some kind of diplomatic gr idea group at that point. We could have gotten diplomatic instead or trade. Mm, but yeah. I don't think it would have made that big of a difference. But soon we won't have to worry because we will have all of the Swedish land for ourselves. Ooh, England is a, in a war with Castile right now. That is interesting. Especially because England is getting beat. What is England's fleet? England actually seems to have lost some ships. You have definitely some trade ships. I think I could beat England's navy right now. What about the armies? Uh, not quite yet. I think I'll still wait for Sweden, but we're definitely gonna keep an eye on this. Um, if we end up being in a good position, I might even start moving the armies over there. I kind of want to go to... Build some more of these. Move this part of the army first. And the rival of our rival. Protect against Lithuania. Have a bigger army. We'll complete that almost instantly from taking over Sweden. We might as well take that then. There's like the Lohenburg. Well, we already want that, but we already can. So let's just protect against Lithuania. I think, we'll, I think as I said, we'll get it automatically whenever Sweden is integrated just by taking over their troops. And you go to Aberdeenshire. Just gonna keep these guys in stop, I think. You go there, pick up the boats that are created for you. So could we possibly, oh they're building them all here, like idiots. So we're building 8, mm, and we had 13 right? Um, I think I want to go up to 24, so we need 11. And then we're going to build a Carrick once we have money for that. Got some more discovery spread. Uh, let's just lose the diplomatic tech. So we're starting to see, soon see the, the new world. I might go 
I might go if we need an a diplomatic idea group. Or are we, we are gonna go quality next. And I don't think we're gonna playing enough for the next one. But were I playing this game to the end, I would probably have gone for exploration as one of the next two groups. <coughs> might even have prioritized that. Uh, like taking instead of taking diplo group first, I would have waited with this for the third group and then taking it there. I think, but I was pretty, I was pretty focused on actually getting the um, achievement in this run. So, yeah, I don't know. I think I would have done it like that if I were to change it. Uh, do we wanna go for the trader? I don't think so. Did we already get the? Construct again, have more. Oh, we're not gonna do that. And send more. Did we? Did we already get a bigger army than Denmark? Yeah, Lithuania for some reason lost a lot of troops. They're not in a war. Did they just end the war? I'm not sure. Definitely got that achievement or mission really quickly. I don't think we're gonna do any of these. I would like to take this, but it's well, they might not be too strong now. But I I don't want to go to war with them right now while England is weak. Well, England isn't that weak. Well, we'll see. I'm not gonna choose the mission right now. How about you, Austria? Not doing anything. We're so close to integrating Sweden now. Can you feel it? It's gonna be amazing. Actually means we can cancel four of those. No, we're just gonna keep them. We have plenty of li uh, force limits. Uh, Burgundy... Was I improving with Burgundy? Oh yeah, for the mission, yeah. I forgot. And we're still uh, way away from doing that. Let's just pop top up on some guys. Give you some... Decent love down here. 1% away, can you feel it? Oh, so close. Why is it saying March? It's w we're one point away. Bam! Bam! Bye, Sweden. It was not nice knowing you. <coughs> Sail the fleet down here. Get the trade fleet. That's also galleys. Did they not have more trade fleet than this? So they didn't have any trade fleet. Interesting. But we now have this huge army. I think we're gonna sail all armies over to England now and deal with them over there. Gonna get all these transport ships. We might actually have too many now. Yeah. Oh well. 
as long as we're not over force limit, well, we add force limit. Might want to get rid of a few of them to get some more. We do have quite a lot of galleys now, though. Damn. And then, um, yeah, now we have to upgrade again, but not that much. So how are we doing with force limit? We're not over force limit on land units, so that's nice. Uh, we do need to give nobility some land now. Actually, before we do that, let's just do the state thing. You're gonna be a state. You're gonna be a state. You're gonna be a state. Do we wanna make you a state? No. But we do probably wanna keep this. We don't care about this. Just walk down there. Oh, over here. And now we give them some land. Uh, I want to give them some land with military tech, or military points. Probably like this. You can get this ability. Mm. So much money, or so much land, so much Denmark. So we could do Scandinavia. Oh, we need admin tech 20, that's gonna be a while. But we now have one of the biggest armies in the world, I think. Yes, we do. And. Yeah, Poland, Poland bigger than Poland, bigger than England. I think it's probably time. England is still at war. If we declared this war, mm, Moscow would join though. Is is Moscow part of the, the other war? No. So we would have to go to war with Moscow. Which is a problem. Because we don't really have any allies to deal with them, and they would just invade. I could build a. If we could get this. If we could get this above 10 development. Then I could build a. Could also just drop the duck. What's the ducks do? A duck. Local sailors. Just just drop this and then build a build a fort here. Which means that th they won't really be able to get that ma many gains and then hopefully France will march over there. I'm not sure. So France would join, why won't you join? Not owing 10 favors, having... Fighting in another war, and distant war. Yeah. Let's wait a little bit and see. If, if England gets really weak, maybe... It does look like England is doing its usual thing of just like standing around with its army in England until it loses this war down here. We can definitely defeat England now. The problem now is that England has kind of somehow gotten Muscovy to be their allies. No, you want? I wanted you to go there. And then you go here with the army. Oh, they both want more now. Greedy little fuckers. Well, I think any of this land is probably okay. One more. Get some Finland. 
Why is this not going up? Is it because the land is so shitty? Yeah, it is. Bavaria. Still no good ones. Well, we could go to war with Li Lithuania now. I guess we, that's what we could do. Um, I think we could take Poland, Lithuania. Like Poland has 44,000 troops. We have 49. Poland is tech 10. Lithuania is tech 8. I think we could do it. I think maybe that's what we do. We, I start a spy network on Lithuania. We take this mission. We then claim Mitau. And then we go to war, take those three provinces uh, for some humiliation. Well, I think I'll prioritize humiliation and then if I can also get um, get some provinces. Fabricate claim on Northumberland. I think that's what we're gonna do. Let's get this build. No, let's go over here. Okay, so... Uh, we need us... Uh, I think we just add one extra horse and an extra horse and an extra cannon. So, this one we put here, and then we buy a, what is this one? This is a horse and a cannon. Oh, we need some money. And then this one just needs a horse. And then we have two pretty nice armies, 20 size, size 26. We do need another leader, which is part of the reason why we need this. By the way, I forgot to check. Yeah, we have a strong claim on our heir, which is... He is old. He might die before our king, which would be bad. Maybe we should just make our king into a... general for now. Just to make sure that he dies before the heir. And then you go for the other army. So you'll then pack down here. So one will go for Lithuania, one would go for Poland. I might actually have to put both in Poland, now that I think of it. Poland it had quite a huge army that we need to deal with. Of course, our general died. Uh, let's just let's could get one for the nobility. Yeah, we can. We can grant generalship. And he was pretty good. Three, two, two, one. Not that bad. So we send you here to stop. I think. I think I'll get go get the other one and put them into memo and then we'll take care of Poland first uh, lose manpower or dockets I think I'll lose the manpower and get a development in Schilland let's just get some military development there as well yeah I think I should change either no, I, w I think we're gonna keep the military focus. Uh, no, it's a long time. I think we're gonna keep the military focus, at least for now. It's not why we're behind in admin tech. We don't really need... We don't need these things that much. Yeah, we should definitely have gone for innovative instead.
We'll do that as Frankenburg, I think. Oh, we have a fort here we are maintaining. Do I even want a fort here? No. I don't expect anyone to get that far. I want a fort here, though. So we're gonna buy a fort here. In case we have to fight Muscovy um, when we fight England. How are you doing in this war? You are losing pretty badly. How are you doing? You're also in a war, so you could probably not help us that much right now anyway. I think we take the war with Lithuania and um Oh you are in a war. If we could somehow get to war with England without Muscovy. But I don't think Muscovy's war is a problem for them. But I would gladly answer. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, that's just not a good possibility right now. Genoa would be helping, but oh, they are even they are out of Siena to go all of this. So Genoa is just a shit shit breakdown there. Anyway, uh, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider the like button, subscribing. Hope to see you in my next video, and until then, have a great day!